and spit it over. Yup, yup, man, y'all know the vibes this smooth life time, man. We are back with another video, man. How my smooth life has been. Yeah, yeah. I ain't made a video in like a week. It felt like it's been forever, but hey, man, I got my five things I like about my car, and I'm about to show you guys. It's gonna be more than five, though. I'm gonna let y'all know that now. But uh, go ahead and like the video, and if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe, and if you're not, then I got a good video for you guys. But you know how we gotta start our videos. Cold star. Let's get back. First thing I want to talk about is the interior. I love it so much for a Camaro SS. I got a 2SS, so I got the full package. So I'm gonna start with, it's not that dark you're not gonna see, but I have the illuminated. My Camaro is all illuminated at night. I get the colors here. I got the, the light strip is a 2SS and I got like 27 different colors to choose from. I just say 30. So I like the seats. I love the leather seats. I love the bolster. I love the bolster. I love the SS right here. And I mean, I like how they carry the leather in the back seat too and then get cheap with it. I love the steering wheel. The whole interior intact, I like. It's like it's the perfect sporty feel flat bottom. Got the SS on the steering wheel and it's like, it's, it's, it feels good, it's good leather. You got the Apple CarPlay. Let me go ahead and stop that. You know that J. Cole just dropped, that J. Cole. If you don't like J. Cole, listen to him, you need to. It'll, it'll change your life. But I like the Apple CarPlay. So you just push Apple CarPlay, it pops up. It has everything, music, phone log, that, your maps. And just like the lights, you can kind of see them now. So you just go here, slide over, lighting, light strip, 24 different colors. <laughs> I'm glad I counted these. You have 24 different colors to choose from on your, on your like, on your door strip, your cup holder, I got that mask. And your, your other door strip over there. So let's say we want to see like a a pink, like an AMG type color. Give it some time, and it changes. It changes up here too, but it's you know, it's not dark enough. But it changes to pink. So that's one of them. Like I love the interior in here. It looks so nice. Shut the car off. And like the sunroof too. This is an added option. I mean, everybody don't get a sunroof, but I was lucky enough, lucky enough to get mine with a sunroof. So I mean, I like it. It gives it more lighting. I don't really open it that much. I mean, that's not really a thing for me, but for videos, perfect. You can see me better. But okay. Oh, and also, that's the interior, you guys. I mean, it's a sport. It's a sports car, so it feels sporty, muscly. You feel me? It don't feel as chunky and thick as like a Mustang or a. I feel like Chargers and Challengers those feel chunky, and Mustang feels a little bit more chunkier. But this is perfect for me. So, I love the interior. That's like one of my favorite parts. That's why I got it to SS because I feel like this looks better than the vet. This, oh, what did he say? Hey. Oh. Hey. This, is, this interior is better than the vet's interior. They yes, sir. Like, I feel like the budget was better for this. It was a lot higher. And yeah, the 2SS package comes with the upgraded both speakers. It's like a nine speaker package. It's nine speaker package. The premium auto comes with 2SS. So it's, it's like nine speakers in the back and in the all around. So for a coupe, I mean, nine speakers, that's a lot for just a little coupe, but. I know y'all know I'm gonna give y'all a little, a little dose, a little taste of what these bowls sound like. So y'all go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and play a little something with some bass in it or something with a little hang out. Matter of fact, I got y'all. Y'all know I can't go nowhere without my, I only gotta put no 12s in here, no sub. And this is only, it's only halfway up. Camaro, they did it right when it comes to interior and exterior. The body of the 6th gen before the refresh is perfect. Yeah, it's perfect. But that concludes the interior. But then again, they're discontinuing our car sooner or later. I might cry. Okay, so that was the interior of the 2SS. Now let's get to the exterior. Oh my God. So I love the body lines of this car. Like, I added a front splitter and the side skirts and the diffuser, but the body lines of this car, like, if you look from this angle right here, it's just beautiful. Like, you got your hood vents, but you see how you got the little, like, the breakup part in, in the middle? You got the front fascia. I love this front fascia better than the, the newer ones, the 2019s and up. That's why I went and bought this one, actually. 
But I blacked out my badges, but I love this. Like, come on, man. You, you don't get no better than this. Or ZL1. But same body lines. I love the look. The stock goods is cool. I like the, the these brakes. I was told, like, I did my research. Like, the best quality for, like, this type of rotor and the four-piston Brembo's. Like, this is, like, the most, like, the best quality set you can get. Like, people like to, people like to trade out their, like, brakes with the... What is it? The power stop, the power stop pads, which is less, is less, um, less brake dust. But I mean, they say best quality stopping and stuff is the stock Brembo's that come with this. Like you can upgrade the ceramic pads, you can get a sort of slide of drill rotors and all that. But that's more racy, racy type stuff. But these brakes, they work good. Trust me, I've been in situations where I needed to brake and it worked. And also, hmm, I turned out my tail lights as y'all can see. But I just love the shape of the car. See the diffuser and all that with it. Let's get it from a little light into it. You see, I got updated, updated my updated my little my exhaust. I got an axle back. I also love the sound of the car. So I'm gonna let you guys hear it. Let me know what y'all think. I love it. Like that's one of like my favorite things. The LT, they say LS, which is the older engine, but the LTs sound great. So let's get to he needs Excuse some me. milk. <laughs> but let's get to this real quick. Let me show y'all how good. This SS sounds to me. This is with no headers. It still has both cats, sec primary and secondary, and it has the, just the axle back. So you guys just listen. Let's prop you guys up. Come on, man. Come, like, let me close this. How can you not love the sound of that, you guys? How can you not love the sound of that? Like, come on. Like, wait till I get headers and all that, which I'm planning on doing in the future. You a subscriber, you're gonna see, and if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. You're gonna see the whole build of my baby Lola, my Camaro 2SS. Man, come on, ready? It got me hyped, y'all see my energy just went up. Bro, I just love the sound, but it doesn't pop as much like that all the time. It pops like, it's like half and half. Like some days they'll pop crazy like that. Some days they'll just rev up and just die down, but it'll be loud. But yeah, man, like, and I'm gonna show you guys, like, it's an automatic, it's an A8. Oh my, they be like, oh my God, you didn't get a manual. Why didn't you get a manual? Only men draw manuals. Well, I'm gonna show y'all why the A8, I feel like, well, of course it's faster, but I'm gonna show you why it's better. Cause you can downshift. You can downshift with the paddles. I mean, there's no clutch. Throw it over in the auto. And race auto so basically you're gonna downshift in the second or third gear whatever roll you want to do mainly second i'm not making that much power to where i'm gonna roll in third and fourth gear but i'm gonna i said roll <laughs> spin but you can downshift in the second beep 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 throw it over while you're accelerating and start shifting automatically like come on man it's like a, a fucking dump knob my boy it's like come on man like i'm gonna show you guys when i get into the driving part I just want to, we're going to admire the shape of this car real quick. Cause like, look at that, man. Oh my God. With the side skirts too. I love the look of it with the side skirts and everything into it. Like, I love it. Like, it just looks so beautiful. You guys like, this is, this is really my, this is really my dream car. Like I'm young. I just turned 21. I'm just not telling y'all. This is the first time I'm telling you my age. I just turned 21. And as a young man growing up, Teenager, I always, my, it was my dad's fault. I'm, I'm going to put a picture of the first car that me and my dad, my dad got me a Camaro. It was a V6. It was like a 2012. Put a picture up right here. And I had that for like a year or two. Well, two years really. Went to college. Got my money up. We got this bad boy right here, man. Well, this bad girl. My bad, Lola. I'm sorry, Lola. Got this bad girl right here. It was his fault. He planted it. He started his beast, and I'm gonna keep going. I'm, next car is EO1. I'm telling you guys, next car is EO1. But that's it, man. Like I'm gonna show you guys the transmission and just how 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 it sounds driving with Camaro stuff. And I'm pretty sure if you're a Camaro owner, you know this. And if you're not, I'm gonna teach you just how to like if you want to roll race with an automatic A8 or the A10. A10 does the same thing. This is it, you guys. So let's get into the car. <laughs>
Okay guys, so we're back in the car. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about once I get to, give me a little open straightaway, straightaway road. But you can see we're back on the road. I'm gonna let you guys know and show you guys my most favorite thing about this car. Okay, so when you're in an automatic, and this one you can put it in manual mode. You see I'm in fifth gear right there. If you can see it says fifth gear. So if I wanna say I'm doing a, a 30 roll, shift down to fourth, third, second and I go and put it over so I mean that's the best part I didn't really have much room to spread like to spread my legs out but you see it's that simple just going it you can go down second to third manually and once you're at the right speed which is from like a, once you do like a from a like what a 20 to like 50 you can do in a sec second gear 20 to 50 roll in this car I mean, 60 is gonna kind of be pushing it because you're gonna feel like you're gr grinding gears, but I also love that too. I usually use my man, I use my manual mode to downshift too, so I can get them pops, and that's my secret. Like a lot of people ask me, how do you get the pops like that in the automatic? I'm trying to tell you, man, you gotta use you gotta use the paddle shifters, man. Because once you use the paddle shifters, like it's like a manual, but it's not like a manual. If you understand what I'm saying, y'all probably can't see up there, but so you, you see, I'm just driving regular and drive. Just regular, automatic life, you feel me? But when I wanna get freaky with it, <laughs> freaky with it, or if I wanna get like, from just a normal automatic, that's when I start using my paddle shifters. So roll races, paddle shifters, downshift, throw it in the regular drive once we take off. When I'm downshifting, I use my paddle shifters for more noise and more control over like where I'm, where I'm downshifting at, or to what, to, so it's not like the easy, the slowly like, cause they try to, with an automatic, they try to keep the RPMs low. So I just use that, and honestly, that's really it. That's my most favorite thing about this car. I'm gonna see y'all guys at my house, and here we go. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. Showed you my top things that I love, not like I love about my car. God bless you guys, be safe. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Smooth Life Ties out.